disarmingly disturbing, brilliantly sleazy, unflinchingly immoral. Hey YouTube, your girl Marcita V here, and that is how I would describe Jake Gyllenhaal's character Lou in his new movie Nightcrawler. When this streetwise, fast-talking thief who is barely scraping by selling stolen goods happens upon a freelance photographer filming at an accident scene, he immediately becomes fascinated with this lifestyle and the idea of making money doing the same thing. He asks enough questions to find out potentially how much money he could make, what, he, what equipment he needs, then steals a racing bike and pawns it to buy a camcorder and police scanner. And it is on. Listening to the police scanner to be tipped to the next accident or crime scene so he can arrive first and get up close and film every shocking, gory moment. This devilishly ingenious character is a heinous self-promoter spewing rapid-fire dialogue that resembles conversation from a training manual for Management Speak 101. This guy is so uniquely unreal. He's surreal, but at the same time so unbalanced, proven by the depths at which he is eager to stoop, to plunge rather, to create his own story and capture it on film, reducing him to the lowest, most foul, despicable, lowlife, out to further his own agenda like any ordinary, everyday criminal. This movie also stars Renee Russo, who is the near to being washed up TV producer working at a struggling TV station where shock value and sensationalism being used to attract and maintain viewers is the daily fare. Riz Ahmed plays Rick, an unwitting homeless kid who Lou hires as his ride-along assistant to help monitor the police scanner and find the fastest route to the next shooting, crime, or accident scene. Little does Rick know that his life will soon be imitating art. This movie is an intense thriller and Jake Gyllenhaal delivers an exceptional, almost too believable performance as Lou. This movie left me feeling a little unclean just sitting there watching it and hoping there aren't too many Lou's out there chasing stories tonight. So if you're not afraid to take a walk on the dark side of journalism, Go see Nightcrawler. That concludes my movie review, YouTube. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you again. YouTube, be safe. Take care. That's all for now. We'll see you soon.